Hi everyone, it's Caroline and today's recipe is how to make some special fried rice. Right, come to mama. Mm. Now you all know the drill, we've got to get everything prepared before we start cooking. And to be honest, the fried rice is all about leftovers, so it's kind of whatever's in your fridge. Now I've got some shrimps, these are raw, and I'm just going to chop these into chunks actually. You can use some cooked ones. I have cold rice left over from last night, always got leftover rice. And just break it all up before you start cooking, it's easier just to tip in. Fried rice always works better with cold rice, okay, because it means it doesn't go mushy when it goes into the pan. We are now ready to cook. So in goes a couple of tablespoons of peanut oil, or you could use vegetable oil, a couple of teaspoons worth of sesame oil. Add in the shrimps, chopped garlic, and I just want to wait until these shrimps are practically cooked. Some chopped chicken. Again, this is cooked chicken, leftovers. About half of my spring onions going in now. Gotta be quick, don't want that garlic to burn. Now the frozen peas. And the rice. Stir everything together. So to cook the egg, the way I've always done it is basically I push the rice to like one side. So I make a space at the bottom of the pan. Mine's a good non-stick pan so I don't need to add any more oil. But if you don't think your egg's going to come off the pan, put some in. <laughs> now pour the egg in a thin layer like that. And I basically leave this to settle for a bit as if you're making an omelette. And you can see it cooks very quickly on the bottom of the pan. And then I move that first layer to one side. And I let the rest cook. It's going to chop up a little bit so it cooks through. And it's just still a little bit wet, but I'm, it's fine. I'm going to stir it into the rest of the rice. And basically the heat from the rest of the rice is just going to, it's going to finish off cooking the egg. What I'm going to add in is a couple of tablespoons of some soy sauce. About that much. There you go. I like to add a tablespoon of oyster sauce because I think it gives it a bit more flavour. So just the soy sauce and the oyster sauce. Stir that in. Last but not least, a sprinkle of white pepper. Spoon into a bowl. I'm going to add a sprinkle of some more spring onions on top. Right, come to mama. Mmm. 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 Rice just makes me happy. <laughs> Especially my special fried rice. <laughs> but have fun with this. I mean, it really is just like a leftover dish. You know, never throw away rice. My mum always told me. You can always keep it in the fridge and then use it the next day. And kind of throw in whatever's in your fridge. So if I had, I would normally do this with some chasu pork, like the sweet Chinese pork, or you could put, you know, any some ham in if you want. But this is a chicken and prawn one. Obviously some eggs and you also whatever vegetables you want. If you want to make it a bit healthier, use brown rice. That's also another nice tip. Yum. Right, well I'm going to finish off this whole bowl to myself. And I hope you all enjoy this as much as I am. 